ICD-9CM Coding Coding Conventions Conventions are symbols, abbreviations, punctuation, and instructional notations that are found in the ICD-9CM. Some of these conventions are used in all three volumes of the ICD-9CM, and some are only used in only one or two of the volumes. Knowledge of where the conventions are used is very important. The first convention that we're going to look at is NEC. NEC means not elsewhere classifiable or is the equivalent to the word other. It is used only in Volume 1, the tabular list of the ICD-9CM. It is used when the diagnosis is specific, however the tabular list does not provide a separate code for that diagnosis. Or it is used with poorly defined terms that warn the corridor that specified terms of the diagnosis being coded are classified to different code numbers. NOS, not otherwise specified or unspecified, is only used in Volume 1, the tabular list. It indicates codes that are not specific and should only be used after the coder has asked the physician for clarification. Brackets are used only in Volume 1, the tabular list. They enclose synonyms, alternative wording, or explanatory phrases. The presence or absence of the phrase within the brackets does not affect the code assignment. Parentheses are found in both Volume 1, the tabular list, and Volume 2, the alphabetic index. The parentheses include supplementary words or non-essential modifiers. These non-essential modifiers do not affect the code description. It is important to always read the words in parentheses. Non-essential modifiers are found in Volume 1 and Volume 2 of the ICD-9CM. These non-essential modifiers are words in parentheses that do not affect the code assignment, but they are used to further clarify the diagnosis. In the example, Hypertension, which is code 401.9, can be described by a physician as arterial hypertension or essential hypertension. These words are included in parentheses to signify to the coder that it, the code does not change. Subterms are modifiers that do affect the code assignment. These subterms are found underneath the main term. The words benign or malignant do change the, the code assignment of hypertension. The colon is used in Volume 1 after an incomplete term. The incomplete term needs one or more of the modifiers that follow it in order to be assignable. In the example, fracture of must be modified but the terms be below it. Fracture of leg, or fracture of arm, or fracture of head. The brace is used to, con to connect a series of terms appearing on the left of the brace to a common term on the right of the brace. It is used in Volume 1, the tabular list. In the example, the brace is connecting the words on the right, the word on the right, to the words on the left. Leg fracture, arm fracture, head fracture.
Bold type is used for all codes and titles in Volume 1, the tabular list. This is helpful in identifying the codes that are able to be assigned. Italicized type is used for all exclusion notes and it identifies codes that are not usually sequenced first. Italicized type is used in both Volume 1 and Volume 2 of the ICD-9CM. Slanted brackets are used in Volume 2, the alphabetic index. The codes that are found in slanted brackets should be sequenced second. This is used to record the etiology or cause of and the manifestation of a disease or injury.